Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all doing great. In today's video, we're gonna be covering all of the latest information that's just dropped in regards to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. There's been a brand new promotional event happening over in Japan in regards to a ecological society webinar, uh, or it's coined as that, where you can go on to a, what looks like a webcam sort of call with Jack from Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, the Paldea region, and then get involved with some research that's been going on and it gives us a bit more information about some of the Pokemon, how they interact with each other and the reveal of a brand new Pokemon as well. So the website, as I say, is this website we're on now. It'll be linked down in the description if you want to check it out in your own time. But as you can see, we can go down here. Jack is there. He's leading the webinar. And uh, then there's a bit more of a breakdown about how Pokemon interact around the Paldea region. So you get a bit more information about what's in this webinar as well. And then you can join the webinar as well and it'll take you into a video where it looks like you're in a call with other people but they're just other Pokemon doctors and stuff like that and then it'll take you through everything that's covered in this latest video but the big news is a brand new Pokemon has been revealed and thankfully Cerebi has posted the video up on their Twitter page so just specifically with this new Pokemon as you can see it is here and it is going to be all based around Diglett which is uh, we'll get into in a minute but the thing is it's a regional form or a regional fake and if we go back to some some of the other content that we've already covered in regards to the leaks specifically about Riddler Koo he posted this out not that long ago to say hi to our first R fake so regional fake he's already confirmed that the R stands for regional and now he's confirming that the F stands for fake so it is a regional fake confirming that these are in the game they're not regional forms they're regional fakes so we'll get into the video now and it'll give us a bit more in-depth information and insight into why they are regional fake and not regional forms i'm going to watch it on lutu's page so because cerebes was all cut off so here we go look what huh what pokemon is that what seems to be so-called diglett and as you can see there's a bunch of them i've never seen a pokemon quite like that one could it be Diglett? It resembles Diglett, but its coloring is different. So it's obviously not Diglett. Could it be a regional form unique to Paldea? This many Diglett of different color in one place. So lucky. Is this possible? They must be an evolved form of Diglett. Instead of evolving into triplets like Doug Trio, they adapt to a marine environment with another form, which is kind of interesting. Look, a major discovery. It is a different form. It's a major discovery. Aye, Jack's knots are cut off here. So Jack's knots up to that point was that. What is this Pokemon? I must fill time with a survey. Survey of 15 seconds as usual. And they'll do like ask you a question here when you do the webinar. Is this a Paldea form? Hypothesize. Would Grand type Diglett live? Uh, near water like this in the first place? Probably not is the, the answer to that. I have to agree. Uh, they do have a certain animatic similarities and it is possible that a regional form could have a different coloration, which we've seen from other regional forms. This is a major discovery. They are lengthening their bodies, big long beach boys. This settles it. Since their appearance is different to the extent, they must be a completely different species. This is the first time we're seeing this in Pokemon. What do the researchers in Paldea region think about this? Their form and movements indeed look like Diglett, but they are probably different Pokemon. So confirming it pretty much. Uh, there is a memo, let's see. This Pokemon that lives on the beach or in the sea of the Paldea region would be Wiglet, confirming its name as well. So it is gonna be called Wiglet. Although they appear to be a Paldean form of Diglett, we've learned that they live and eat differently. So pretty much confirming that it's gonna be a completely different Pokemon altogether. So regional fake kind of fits the bill perfectly. Uh, they both borrow underground. Apparently Jack dropped a bomb at the end. So there we go. Pokemon ecology is so deep and that's where the video comes to an end and wraps up. So this is the brand new Pokemon Wiglet. This is pretty fun that they've released it in this kind of style, like a webinar sort of thing that you're seeing. And uh, as I say, it's part of the overall uh, webinar itself it does go into other aspects of the video here but you can see the wiglet here whether or not that this is an evolved form where you're going to get all 
five of these or four of these together instead of the Doug Trio because they do touch upon that in this trailer here they talk about uh, it's an evolved form of Diglett potentially so it does look like it is a completely new Pokemon though and that has been confirmed and it doesn't appear to be a regional form which is also being confirmed in this as well uh, it's a brand new Pokemon it'll have a brand new Pokedex number and it is potentially I would say going off Riddler Koo, very reliable source that it is a regional fake and it is a brand new Pokemon altogether just with similarities to something like Diglett which is kind of covered in this trailer here. Now I did also check the Pokemon, the official Pokemon Scarlet and Violet website to see if there'd been any updates on here, but there is nothing as of yet to confirm Wiglet as a Pokemon on this website. So that is something that we'll probably see further down the line. But like I say, the whole Ecological Society webinar promotional video uh, website that we've got here is a, something different that they've done uh, that we've not really seen before but something really cool like I say they talk about different uh, interactions of Pokemon you've got Surviper you've got Zangoose as well and how they interact in the wild you've got uh, a bomber snow how it can interact with players if you get near it it can create a blizzard and things like that so there's a bunch of stuff in the webinar that gives us a bit more information about the games in general and how we are to expect Pokemon when we play these games and uh, how we can view Pokemon around the Paldea region in our adventures when we play them. So very cool, very short update today, but the big thing for us is the Wiglet. The Wiglet has been confirmed and uh, it is a very cool Pokemon. Big shout out to Lou 2 here as well. A Cerebi did have the video up on their page, but it kept glitching out on me. So I've used the original here from Lou 2 who's also um, linked it as well and uh, it got a bunch of information about the wiglets and other information about the sandals and stuff like that that we can see but this is the big one a discovery luck wiglet let me know down below what you think of this brand new pokemon like i said it's a quick update today with this information if we get anything more for scarlet and violet i'll sure drop a video on the channel so if you've enjoyed this one you want to keep up to date with all future updates before the drop of pokemon scarlet and violet hit the subscribe button and do consider hitting the like button as well it really helps out the video and helps the channel out in general so thank you so much for tuning in friends have a great rest of your day let me know about Wiglet down below. I'd love to hear about it. Till next time, take care. Bye-bye.